Wow, I needed this tanning session bad. I'm so crazy in my head today. What's going on, Janet? I... Listen, Wanda, I'll tell you, but you can't tell anyone. What happened? I had a... Mm, bit of a scare. Are you okay? Shh, shh, shh. I'm, I'm fine. It's just... My monthly friend came a little late, and I thought I might be- You thought you were pregnant? Shh! Hey, shh. Clint is right over there. Anyway, I'm not. I just thought I was. I was really freaked out because that is the last thing I need. With all the crap in my life right now, with everything with Hank, <laughs> That's what the world needs. A little Clint Barton walking around. Nice shooting there, hotshot! Are you two still seeing each other? That would entail the two of us having an adult conversation about our feelings, which clearly is not either of our strong suits. Ugh, can you imagine me with a kid? Like a kid could grow up normal in this environment. Avengers should not have kids. Superheroes should, should not have kids. That should be a rule. And you thought you could have two? What? What? What does that mean? Two of what? Oh, um, uh, nothing. No. What did I just say? I'm tipsy and all. Margaritas and New York Sun do not mix. I gotta pee. You gotta pee? I gotta pee. I'll be back in two shakes! What are you hiding from me, Janet? Please, Doctor Strange, I don't understand. What is happening to us? Most of you I have met, but others I have not. My name is Doctor Stephen Strange. I am a practitioner of the mystic arts, and I have achieved master level. I am talking to you from the astral plane, a metaphysical dimension layered on top of the one in which you live. I have taken the liberty of casting a handful of cloaking spells around this entire area. I have done all this to keep the unwanted eyes and ears of those who would choose to harm you blind, at least momentarily. I fear we do not have long. Clearly, you are in immediate and grave danger from a magical force of immense power. I am truly sorry I could not be here to stop this before it started. But a great deal of my studies include intensive meditations. I was in a place where I could not see what was happening to you until it was too late. But now I see the magics have been violated in an attack aimed at you. Doctor, please! Who did this? Who murdered our teammates? The events of the past day. The devastation. The bedlam. I must ask you. Is there anyone the Avengers have dealt with who have this level of mystic power? Someone who could orchestrate this level of chaos. No. Not Wanda. Agatha? Are you here? Wanda Maximoff. You gave me a bit of a fright just now. Come. Sit. We haven't spoken in a good long time. Agatha, I... Why do people think I once had two children? Where are my children? Sit down, Wanda. Your memory isn't what it once was. But sit down and we'll have a... Tell me where my children are! No. No. She She's a good person. She, she's our friend! She doesn't have that in her blood. Actually, she does. She is Magneto's daughter. And before she was an Avenger, she was a mutant terrorist. And she married a robot. No offense. I mean, he was, is, the robot. I mean, the, the Vision is a robot. If I was dating a robot, you'd all talk about me behind my back. Really? What are you even doing here? I was helping with the aliens a second ago. I don't understand. Why do you think she Wanda's would- life has had a lot of misfortune, but nothing suggests she was capable of this. Even if you include what happened with her children, and that was sad. I delivered those children. 
Did something happen to her children? Well... <sighs> Go do your talking, Reed. I got Sue and Johnny. They... it... um... It ends up that she conjured them into existence, if that's the word. They weren't actually... real. She created them with her hex powers. She willed them into existence. She wanted them very badly, is how it was told to me. What? She, in a way, tricked herself into giving birth to them, but they... they didn't really exist. Agatha Harkness. That... woman. Her mentor. Agatha, she... She was the one who figured out what the children really were. So she erased them. She took care of it. Why didn't you people come to me when this happened? Doctor, what are you thinking? Please, please, hear me out. We don't have much time. There has always been an uneasy structure to Maximov's power. As a mutant, she was born with her powers over magic. Her hex power. It wasn't earned through spirituality. It was given to her without understanding of its consequence. But maybe the rules for her don't apply? I'm sorry, but didn't she have trouble controlling her powers in the past? Yes. Wait! If, if it's chaos magic, then it can be reversed. You can bring them back. Please, Doctor, please reverse this before it's too late. Bring back Scott! Bring back Hawkeye! Bring back! I'm, I, I'm sorry if I didn't make myself clear. Magic isn't an illusion. This... Today, this was not a magic trick. These events, they happened. Your friends have... They are dead. I tried years ago to take Wanda on as a student. But her obligations to her family and to you, her teammates, distracted her. I am unsure as to the level of her power, but her hex has always seemed much too limited to create what has gone on here. We should tell you, Doctor, not too long ago, she tapped into a power source she called the Chaos Magic. She can control the probabilities of reality what and- What are you people talking about? Stop! No! No, Wanda did not do this! Then where is she, Carol? She's the only active member not here. Thor isn't. What about Loki? Could he be capable of this? It seems appropriate of the God of Mischief. Wanda did not do this! And really, I'm offended that you- She's Magneto's daughter? And you're saying she killed the Vision? Her own husband? And Ant-Man? And... And... And Clint. You're wrong. Wanda was with me at the UN. She was right there. Where the hell have you been? First this guy, now you just pop in after we fight off an alien freaking invasion? My suit didn't pick anything up. I didn't know something was happening until a news report popped up. By then, I came as fast as I could. Forget it. You're here now. It's good to have you back, Tony. Don't get ahead of yourself. Anyway, Doc, Wanda was not the one who did this. There's a great possibility, Iron Man, that she may not even be aware of what she is doing. Doctor, I'm sorry I have an immense amount of respect for you, but we cannot accuse a teammate of this kind of terrorism. I need more than your theory. My theory? Listen to me! This chaos magic? The source of her reality-altering powers? I am a master of the mystic art. And I am telling you, there is no such thing as chaos magic. Please, please, forget that we are talking about your friend and listen to me tell you a story of an orphaned mutant with a sordid and violent past. With power she did not earn, nor can she control. Powers she never fully understood. Can you understand? The delicate mindset of a woman, a person who has control over reality? It means reality controls her. Imagination becomes the enemy. Structure disappears. Reality eventually, as she knows it, starts to slip away. Elude her. Blur. Drama. Conflict. Tragedy. They become excuses to change the world to fit the image that she has for it. Anything she doesn't like, she can change. No matter how slight, people, places, things, everything is hers to change. But every time she does that, every time she gives in to her desires, no matter how noble they may be, a little more of her power slips away. She loses herself, her reason. But she struggles quietly every day to keep it in check, to keep it all together. 
For a person of strong mind and body, for a person pure of spirit, the task of coping with these powers would be all-consuming. But here's a woman for whom, uh, by the nature of her upbringing and chosen occupation, every day is stressful, chaotic. And after a life lived with lost love, violence, and drama, what does she do? She says to herself, I deserve happiness. I want to bring something into this world that is good, that I can love. And she gives birth to children, even though she can't. She played mommy to make herself feel like someone she thinks is normal. And that ends tragically as well. If I told you a story like this, you'd say to yourself, this sounds like a person who has lost control of themselves on a deep, psychological level. You'd say, this sounds like a disturbed person. Now, does anything I have described not sound like Wanda Maximoff? No, 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 no. But Wanda doesn't even remember what happened to her children. Thank the Harkness took care of that, too. Maybe she remembered. If... If that's true, if, why is she attacking us? I don't know. You're wrong. I truly hope so. But I am not. There's only one way to find out. Doctor, is there anything you can do to help us find her, please? The magics create a te- a, um, a map. I can point you right to her. But I warn you, if this is true then there is no way you could be prepared for what we'll see when we find her. Kids, dinner! It's your favorite! Yay! You kids play nice today? Ha! Shh! I wasn't going to say anything. You two behave. Yes, Mommy. What am I going to do with you two? Wanda? No. Wanda, please, let me help you. Then go away! I told you we should have punished them all! Stop it! They're going to break us up again! No! No, he's not! He cares about Mommy! He's one of the good- No! Wanda, please. None of this is real. These aren't your children. You don't have children. None of this is real, Wanda. See? Why is he saying this? (laughs) And they are not talking. It's you talking. It's your voice. I hear you. I want to help you. Shut up, stupid! Stop telling me what to do! He loves Mommy. No! Wanda, we've grown very close lately. Right? I... I I want to help you. (laughs) Look. What? No. Red Skull? Troops, you may fire on my mark. Now! Mommy, don't let them take us away. No. It won't happen again. Mommy, I don't want to go away again. No one will ever take you away from me again. Cap! Cap, are you... Oh my god. Someone help him! He's been shot! I'm... uh, I'm okay. She... She attacked me. No. Please tell me she didn't. Uh, guys. She's floating right there. Carol, wait. Do you know what you've done? You killed the Vision, Wanda, your own husband! Do you know that? Do you?! You killed Scott Lang! You killed Hawkeye! Janet is in a coma! Captain Britain, Human Torch, Invisible Woman, you've hurt them all! Stay away from my children. Carol, wait! You've destroyed the Avengers! All of it, it's gone! (laughs) Not so fast, sugar. Rogue? No, 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 keep her away from me! You can't have them. (laughs) Hulk! And Wolverine! We got big trouble, people! (laughs) Everyone! You must act now. No offense, but the Kree was one thing. I don't think we can take out the Hulk, never mind him and Wolverine. Logan, look, it's me. It's Batman. You know? Kid? It's no use talking to them. They're not the real Wolverine and Hulk. 
They're just illusions the Scarlet Witch cooked up. Yeah, well, they hit just as hard. A little help over here. Is it over now? Yes, it's nearly. Wanda Maximov, you will stop this madness now. You are hurting your friends and hurting yourself. This stops now! No! You can't take my children away from me again! Not even you! Mommy's winning! Wait, what is he doing? Shatou, Akra, Maximov, Deston Gutronte, Alad Gura, Repko Agamato! I of Agamotto will show you the truth. You will stop this madness! These magics are not yours to abuse! No! Mommy! Wanda! I've got her. I've got her. Um, where'd the smash and slash go? Gone. Along with the rest of Wanda's power. <sighs> if there was any other way. I'm sorry. Is she breathing? She is alive, but her mind is gone. Her mind was in a delicate state to begin with. Wanda? Colonel, what are we looking for? We'll know it when we... There. God, is that a person? Was. Who is that, Colonel? Agatha Harkness. Jeez. How long has she been rotting down there? Long time. Can you wake her up? She's not asleep. How can we help her? You can give her to me. Give me my daughter. Magneto? Now? How bad is this day going to- Peach. Here. I am so sorry. Xavier was right. It was you. I failed you. Magneto, where are you taking her? So, what happens now? We regroup. Tony, we should probably- I don't think so. Not that I'm much use to you guys anyway, but if I'm not trusted, then I'm done here. See ya, Cap. Damn it. All right. The rest of us, if you have something you need to say, now might be a good time. Look, I want to help, but my family comes first. Ben, we have to go. Sue and Johnny need us. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. T'Challa? I will respect you always, but this team is broken, and I am needed elsewhere. I'm sorry. I must go. Orders from Fury. Natasha, please. I'm just... a shield agent first, Captain. Besides, my brother is gone. There's nothing here for me without Clint. Um, I can't stay. I'll always be here if you need me, but New York needs me first. Good luck, and thanks for everything. Carol? I'm sorry. I can't stay here. It's too... Look at what we've done. What being an Avenger has done to us. What it did to Wanda. The Avengers are dead, Steve. We all have to move on. For the record, it's been the best time of my life. The good times. But the bad will kill us. Or worse. Maybe you should think about that. Steve, what are you thinking? We came together to save people, Sam. That's why we do this, but the Avengers were broken. It hurts me to say this, but maybe we should all move on. So that's it? No more Avengers? Maybe we might come back someday. But for today, we have to find a new way. Our own way. And that means moving forward and starting again. Okay. Look, Steve, I need to check on my family, but I'm with you until the end. I made that decision a long time ago, and I'm sticking with it. 
Call me when you need me, okay? Will do, partner. Avengers, goodbye.